Nice of you to drop in. <laughs> I'm coming for you, Joker. You're going back to Arkham. Due to the weekend rainfall, clear skies seem unlikely in the area. A thick fog is expected to set in tonight and remain until tomorrow morning, with heaviest concentration in the Inaba area. Anyone planning to go out tonight should take care. Now for our hourly weather breakdown. More fog, huh? There's been a lot of that lately. Hopefully it's not a sign of more trouble. Uh-uh-uh. What did I say about changing the channel without asking? Have a great day, even during Golden Week, at your local junior... Oh, I remember Golden Week is where the... Everyone takes a break. Come see for yourself, and get in touch with our products. Every day's great at your Junex. Every day's great at your Junex. <laughs> Dad, they're going to be open during Golden Week. <laughs> I heard. Do you want to go somewhere during the long holiday? <laughs> we can go somewhere? How about it? Got any plans yet? Mm, no, no, no plans. Then let's all go somewhere together. Junus, 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 Junus. <laughs> you sure you want to go to Juness? We can go there anytime. Come on, girl. Time for bed. It's late. All right. Every day's great at your Juness. That's adorable. Uh, watch TV in your room, yeah. Uh, I think the next thing is gonna happen, shit. It's midnight. The fog has set in. Let's see who shows up in the TV this time. I think, I think the next question is Rizzo. And, uh, no one appears to be on the Midnight Channel. Maybe? That, who the hell is that? Oh, look, she's back. Hey. Oh, good morning. Good morning. Feeling better? Yeah. I'll be coming to school again, so that'll be nice. I caused everyone some real trouble. I, it's, I'm sorry. It's fine. Don't blame yourself. No, sorry isn't quite right. What I mean to say is, thank you. My mother's back to work already. The maids are being really supportive. And I think things are going even smoother than before. I wonder if I was trying too hard. Could I be. may have been too caught up in the idea that I had to do everything myself. Ever since the incident, I feel like I can think about these things more calmly. But... Still kind of embarrassing. You guys saw everything, even the things I didn't want to admit. Oh, don't worry about it. Thanks. Yukiko! Oh. Oh, Chie. Well, I'll talk to you later. Alright, I can't skip that too fast. Hmm. 
Yukiko-san is back. That's good. I'm glad the only cutie in the class was able to return, wouldn't you say? Uh, wouldn't you guys agree? What? What? What the fuck is wrong with you, teacher? Whoops, I mean all of you are cute. No, really. Ah, uh, that's uh, kind of sus, man. You sound that to your students. Eh, please don't tell your parents that I said that, will you? I don't want to get in trouble. <laughs> um, anyway, I have an interesting topic for you today. Close your books and take a look at the handout. Sounds like a good time to pick on the city boy, Batcoon. Oh my god. Ah, uh, si, senor, what do you want? What is the greatest canyon in the solar system? Solar system, okay. Uh, solar system. Oh, fuck. Uh, wait. I was say Grand Canyon? Let me go check quick. Ah, uh, thank God. Google saved me. Oh, okay. Wow, you really are from the city. Well, I guess that doesn't have anything to do with it. <laughs> the Valoris mm, uh, Mirrors? I don't know. What, I don't know if I'm saying that right. On Mars is 10 times larger than the Grand Canyon. Mars also hosts hosts uh, Olympus Mons. Olympus Mons? The largest mountain in the solar system. Both the highest mountain and the greatest canyon are on Mars. Isn't that useful information? Sounds useful. I, didn't, I never even know that. Since you got me started on canyons... I'm uh, gonna cover some material on their characteristics. You gave the correct answer. Your knowledge has increased. I'm gonna need that. I, I wanna actually start the next story part. Sorry to keep you waiting. The soap was yours, right, Chie? Thanks! Oh, that smells so good! These instant noodles are just the thing to help me through club. How much longer do I have to wait on this? It still needs a few minutes. So why are we here? Oh yeah, we were gonna ask Yukiko what happened. What? Uh, uh, really? Yukiko-san, I hate to bring up stuff you'd rather not think about, but I need to ask you again. Did you recall anything about when you got kidnapped? No. I thought I might remember something if I let it sit for a while. But as time passes, it only gets hazier. I think... The doorbell rang at the entrance. And someone called for me. But when I woke up after that, I was already in the castle. I'm sorry. No need to apologize. But does this mean her visitor is the culprit? Could be. I don't know. If it's true, then that's one daring criminal. What kind of killer would ring the doorbell? The police are probably looking for witnesses, but I don't think we can expect much from them. <laughs> As if the culprit wore bright yellow clothes at the scene of the crime. I wonder why whoever it is would do stuff like this. We won't know until we confront them ourselves. But we can be sure of one thing. It's no coincidence that people keep ending up in that place. Someone on our side is definitely kidnapping them and throwing them into the TV. It's murder, all right. Oh yeah, we never told you. 
This guy and me are gonna catch the culprit ourselves. The police are out of their league on this case, but we got personas. Never fear, I will get him. Could you lend us a hand? Huh? I'm helping out too. I can't believe someone would throw people into a place like that. I'm gonna sock whoever's doing this. Chie. Let me help too. I want to know why this is happening. Especially if someone hates me so much they want to kill me. I don't want to run away from myself anymore. All right. Then let's all work together and catch this asshole. Agreed. Oh. A new ally. I just ranked up my uh, my four arcana. The investigation team. The investigation team social link has inc has reached level two. Your power to create personas of the full arcana has grown. But how are we gonna find them? We don't have a single lead yet. I'm the third one to be targeted so far, but I have a feeling this isn't the end of it. If we had an idea of who might be targeted next, wouldn't we have an advantage over the killer? Could be. So we'll outsmart them, huh? Yeah, that might work. Okay, so let's see if we can figure out what ties the victims together. First, there was that announcer, Mayumi Yamano. Second, was Saki Konishi, senpai. Third, was Yukiko Amagi. What do they all have in common? Could it be that they're celebrities? Bingo. Plus, they're all women. How dare he target females! Now that's unforgivable. Culprit's gotta be some kind of pervert. Also, what about this? The second and third victims had some sort of connection to the first one. Hey, that's right! Yukiko and Saki-senpai both had connections to that announcer! That's true. Then... Does that mean females connected in some way to Miss Yamano's case are being targeted? I think that's a safe assumption for now. There's another angle we can take too. If another person disappears... You think they'd be on that Midnight Channel? That happened right before Yukiko was kidnapped too! Yeah. It's hard to tell who at first, but what's important is... It's happened before the victims disappeared. Kinda like a... ransom note. We still don't know why that happens, but we'll have to rely on it for now. The next time it rains. By the way, aren't those done by now? Whoa, that's right! Chow time! <laughs> <laughs> hey, could I try just a little bit of that? Just one tiny bite? Hands up the soba, pal. Go get your own if you want some. <laughs> okay. Just one bite. Got it? Do you want to try some? Uh, yeah, I can try a bite. It's so good. The aroma, the flavor, and the texture all combined. This is perfect! Hey, stop eating the whole, all her food. What? Ah! What the hell are you doing? Ah! You ate everything! My fried tofu. I hope you guys understand what this means. Ah, uh, my city needs me. Goodbye. Oh, wait, 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 wait! Stop! I'm sorry. I'll buy you steak. It'll be on me. You hear me? The very best. Steak. My tofu. Come on, Yukiko. There's steak in it for us now. 
We can eat instant noodles anytime we want, right? Well, as long as it isn't too fatty. Okay, we've reached the verdict. You are hereby sentenced to buying a steak. Oh, fuck. What wouldn't be too fatty? Filet? Ooh, filet sounds nice and expensive. Is it really that expensive? I, I'm, I don't know. I know filet mignon is fucking uh, hey, you've got a pony expensive. Too. You're just as much to blame. Ah, you son of a bitch. Man, talk about great timing. We just started serving grilled steak today. We're doing our part to spread this town's specialty dish. Plus, we've already got an excellent grill. Yakisoba griddle. Oh well, steak is steak. It's far from a fillet steak, though. Yukiko, are you okay with this? It's not too heavy for you. I'll eat it. I'm still mad. So back on topic. I wonder what kind of person the culprit is. If you focus just on the announcer's case, it seems like a revenge thing. Maybe it was her lover's wife. But Mizuzu Hiragi had a solid alibi, didn't she? And it seemed like she was already separated from her husband. Really? You know an awful lot about this. Okay, what about the second case? Saki-senpai. She found the announcer's body. Assuming the same person killed them both, then why target senpai? Maybe it was a coincidence. Well, we can't rule out that possibility. But maybe it was to keep her quiet. Like she found evidence that led to the culprit. But the killer just threw the announcer into a TV, right? I don't think he would have left evidence the police, much less a high school student, would catch. Yeah, exactly. Man, I thought the countryside would be a snooze. But it's proving to be a lot more exciting than I thought. Oh, they updated the menu. Huh? Isn't he that detective? Hey, you were at Dojima-san's. <laughs> I'm not. Oh, wait. Hey, this is great timing after all. Dojima-san said that he'll be leaving work on schedule tonight. Could you pass that on to Nanaka-chan? Yo, I'm Adachi, Dojima-san's gopher. I mean, his partner. <laughs> Gopher. Are you this busy every day? Huh? Oh, well, the public see. Oh, fuck. Sorry to butt in, but could it be that the killer targeted Saki Senpai in order to silence her? Um, you sure get to the heart of the matter. Yikes. <laughs> of course, we're also thinking along those lines. She was killed right after the announcer's body was found. If the killer was trying to silence her, there might have been something at the scene only she would have understood. Which would mean that the culprit may be someone close to Miss Konishi. Nothing like that points to Misuzu Hiragi, so... Oh, I might have stumbled across something here. Wait, are you listening to all that? Crap, me and my big mouth. Uh, don't tell anyone I said any of that, or Dojima-san will flay me alive. <clears throat> Relax, kids. The police are on the job. See ya. Your police persona. You were right, Yosuke. The police are totally useless. This also might be in two My parts too. Like usual. Could you shut up about the steak for five seconds? You waited for the two to finish eating, then decide to go into the TV world. Let's see, we find Teddy again. Investigation. Wow, this really is inside the TV. It's Teddy. 
Teddy, then it wasn't a dream. Are you feeling better, Yuki-chan? I did what you said. I've been a good bear. Oh, I see. Good boy. <laughs> well, this bear's part of the reason we want to find the culprit. I'm one of the group now, too. Let's work together, okay? Yep. I was thinking the same thing. That's why I got these ready for you, Yuki-chan. Oh, so these are what everyone's wearing. Thank you, Teddy. You're right. It's just as if the fog doesn't exist. Hey, tell me something. How come you have so many pairs of glasses? Excellent question. Guess what? I'm the one who makes them. I've lived here for a long time, so I came up with some ways to be comfortable here. I see. But don't you need a pair? Ooh, good point. Another great question. Listen to this. My eyes themselves are lenses. You didn't know? Of course not. <laughs> Why are you being so mean? You act like you're not interested. I'm a really dexterous bear. See how smoothly my fingers move? <laughs> what am I even looking at? Ow! Hmm? You dropped something. Oh, that's a pair I kind of screwed up on. Ooh. <laughs> Y Yukiko? <laughs> How do I look? Looks natural. <laughs> <laughs> awesome! Do you like that one, Yuki-chan? I want to wear this one. It's even got a nose guard. Oh, no you don't! How very unfortunate. That pair doesn't have the right lenses in. Guess I should have made an actual pair. Ah, too bad. Here, Chie, your turn. <sighs> Man. All right, fine. <laughs> How'd it come to this? <laughs> That's actually funny. Yukiko-san? Hello? There goes one of Yukiko's laughing fits. I never thought she'd do it when someone besides me was around. These stupid glasses are useless for investigating. I mean, what the hell's this nose for anyway? Nice work, huh? That's what happens when you guys leave me here alone and I get bored. Well, I'm glad that she's in high spirits again. I... <laughs> oh, Chie, the look on your face. <laughs> it was so funny. <laughs> I can't stop <laughs> oh, oh, my stomach. The fourth and the fifth. Fourth and the fifth? What do you mean? I think I might be able to get the fourth and the fifth off. Oh. Uh, that's good. <laughs> really? Really? What? You don't believe me? It's always cancelled. Oh, not every year. I know you wanted to go to Jeunesse, but... I wouldn't mind going a little further out of the neighborhood. Really? <laughs> Can we go on a trip? Uh, well, it might be okay to go on a trip once in a while. I'm sure it'll be crowded everywhere, though. Yay! <laughs> We're going on a trip! Hmm. All right, all right. Then we need to think of some place to go. How about you? You want to come along with us? I want, I want to come. <laughs> Looks like Nanako wants us all to go. Yep. You're be uh, you're gonna be on an 
outing with the Jojimas during the long holiday. Let's bring back lunches. Hmm? Yeah, good idea. We're always eating side dishes for dinner. But uh, I can't cook. And Nanako's not good enough yet to make them by herself. Hmm. Well, it'll work out. That's what we got this guy for, huh, Nanako? Yay! Back lunches! Oh, shit. You have been selected to pack the family's box lunches. Oh, shit. Uh, let's see. Let's see the kitchen. Ah, uh, let's eat it. Tongue hurts. <laughs> you, your eyes water from the odor. Your throat is burning. However, you don't feel well. You decide to go to bed early. <laughs> okay, that's funny. That's hilarious. Alright, let's see what's on the Midnight Channel. I'm getting a phone call. You can now watch other things besides Persona 4 Golden. What the hell does that mean? Oh! So what, if I go to the TV war if I go to the TV? Okay, I can go to Juno's quick. I think I need to go there next. And I think this is almost a good point where we should, uh... This is a good point to end the let's play, but let me see if I really need to go to the uh... Oh no, this is the wrong, the wrong area. Junus, yeah, I need to go to the Junus. Uh, oh no. Wait, do I need to go upstairs? What's our agenda for today? All right, enter the TV Let's world. I think we're at a good point of, uh... Yep. Our next thing is to defeat the shadow that's there. Alright. Do it again. And um, I'd like to thank you guys for watching. This is going to be, I think I'm going to separate this in two parts like I normally do. But I hope you enjoyed watching. And I will have more of this Let's Play out very soon. So I think I'm going to go more with Persona 4. And then I'm going to come back to Outlast. So, we'll, and then I'll also slip in a bit of Pokemon too. Um, but also stay tuned for my Twitch streams on, on the Friday and Saturday. Uh, but if I don't stream on those days, I'll, I'll stream on Sunday. Um, I'm trying to get affiliate. I am uh, very close in getting it. I just need to get uh, the last part of it done where I need to get uh, three views on my page. Like, I just have to have constantly people watching on my stream while I'm actually streaming. But, I, I know I can get this. But, 
stay tuned for that like whatever game or art I stream on Twitch um, follow me on tw ooh, follow me on Twitter follow me on Newgrounds if you have that uh, follow my coffee page uh, that's why you see uh, now a little coffee thing because it's like a I forgot why I forgot Oh my, I just wanted to test something so the alerts for my coffee page will show up on there now. Like it would just show up, at, it shows up on all the different uh, scenes I have. But, uh, I kind of like it, it looks pretty cool. Uh, but that's what I'm going to be using for or when I get tips on coffee. Yeah, but like support me on there if you want to see like some early art, uh, early art that I do. I'm going to, I do have a, a few art I did on uh, before some some of this for D&D that I did for just up to my character um, there's gonna be some twitch doodles on there uh, posted yeah posted on there and um, another update of my of another D&D &D character that I play in Crystal Shroud they already died first um, as, uh, yeah, that's it. Whatever, like whatever I post on coffee is just like early access before I post it on Newgrounds and uh, Twitter. Yeah, so just take a look on there if you have a chance. Um, subscribe to the channel on YouTube if you want to watch more of what I play on here. Uh, either it's gaming. Or drawing or whatever random thing I do on my channel, uh, it will be on here. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next Persona 4 Golden video or Outlast or Pokemon or whatever video I do next. But I'll see you guys next time. And subscribe for more or you're going back to Arkham. Bye bye.